What's going on YouTube? Today I am further south than Luxor. I found myself in a place that is long requested on my TikTok. A place where people have mistaken me for coming from this place. A place where most Egyptians think I came from. And this place is called Aswan, but deeper inside Aswan is the Nubian village, which is where I've been staying at for the past two nights. Last night I did the Nubian wedding. Today we're gonna check out the area and just kind of get an idea of why this place is so special. Hang in tight. I hope you enjoy this video and let's check it out together. What you're seeing here is the souk, uh, which is kind of like the market area. They've got a bunch of different things you can buy as far as like handmade art, hand designs, hand uh, daggers, handcrafted materials, clothes, everything's all handmade. The chili powders, there's a bunch of different chili scents uh, that they use and make all by themselves with their hands and they crush them into a powder there's even some chilies that they use to clean your clothes, which is uh, the one in blue I'm going to show you right now. Ooh. This area is pretty cool. Um, it's very easy to maneuver. It's a lot of twists and turns, little small loopholes here and there. Uh, it's not hard to get lost. For the most part, the people are very friendly. All the Egyptians are very friendly, and kind of that's the rumor about the Aswani people is that they're the most kindest people of all Egypt, and I strongly believe that. Oh yeah, yeah, it's my guy right here, man. How you doing? Fine. Bam. Here you go. Here we go. So these are what, these are my peoples. Like I was here last night, and I met up with them. They show me around, helpful. I'm um, just telling them, you know, people come to Aswan, Nubian right, village. You're welcome. You're welcome to my you're brother. Welcome. See? You're welcome. See? Welcome. Well, I told you, they're just nice people. Nice to come. You know? Is, is there something uh, you can recommend people to do when they come to Nubian village? Yeah. Like, like what? What would you want them to, to do when they come here? You have a good feeling. It's good. It's a good feeling? Yeah, the good feeling. Okay. And there's a lot of work and also. Okay. You like this have people come here to go to Balch. And you, sir? Aziz, I know. We are from Google. We are from the United States. We are from the United States. Every every people here is welcome. Is welcome. No, I have no problem. We are happy here for the people. We tourists especially because this for working here also for us. Yes. Okay. We like this type of people here coming. Okay. Something people tourists and tourists and have guest a friend. Uh, yeah. So the word is everybody, you're welcome to come here and enjoy Aswan. Come enjoy Nubian Village. We are waiting for you and we want you to come visit. Awesome. See? <laughs> It's not so bad here. Uh, I've been in worse, hotter areas, but this one is definitely top two, matching El Guna. Um, it's 108 degrees. It's probably different for anywhere else around the world. We go by degrees because we're funny Americans, but the rumors are true. Luxor and and uh, Aswan are hot, but Aswan is definitely hotter. I totally underestimated it. But the heat makes up for a good view of the Nile. It's right next to where I'm staying, Katoldul, which I'll show you guys later in the video. But check out this view. But I think right now, all the shops and cafes on this block right here is closed. Um, they open at five. 
normally that's kind of an Egyptian thing. They only really come out at night to party, like I said. But once it hits five, you'll start to see things opening up. If I have enough battery by the time this video is over, I'll show you what it looks like. Okay. Okay. This shall mark. Mm. Shall mm. mark. Mm. Okay. No. Here. Eyes. Here. Shall farawla. Okay. Nice. Shall Brazilia. Shai Moz. So this gentleman right here, he had a very interesting business that he wanted to show me when I was walking through the neighborhood. This machine or device you're looking at makes these quilts. And so he passes the device through where his uh, hands are, and then he brings it back and it kind of like a sewing machine almost. I've never seen anything like this before. And the way he did it was so casual and so skilled as if he's done it for many years. I think he's actually done it for many years, but I don't know the name of this device. I uh, thought you guys should know. So guys, the unthinkable just happened. I was attacked by a vicious, brutal dog and it showered me with so much love and it got my clothes all messed up. But the great news is I met another YouTuber here and she's from China. <laughs> oh. Wow. Are you going to... <laughs> are, you, are you gonna pet it? Touch it? I think it's so, so dangerous. <laughs> no, they're not dangerous. Catch not dangerous? Yeah, not, not dangerous for you. Oh. Whoa. So there's a bunch of baby crocodiles here. Like I said, they capture from the Nasser Lake and they bring them over here. So I don't think there's any more here, but I showed you earlier. That's one of the uh, you can. crocodiles. <laughs> so this is the baby crocodile, the small ones. <laughs> It's safe, I think. It's safe. You you can try. I can't focus my finger and my hands on the crocodile. Okay. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Go, you just go. Okay. Wow. Oh my. Catch. Catch me. Yeah. Oh my god. Ew, it's like little baby hands. Just the, okay. the careful. Okay, all right, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I said I met another influencer all the way here in Egypt. Her name is Momo. Yeah. I'll put a link to her Instagram right here, somewhere on the bottom. Uh, check her out. She's all the way to Egypt by herself traveling. And you came from where? I, I'm from China. From China? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. See, this is why you should travel, man. Be courageous like her. <laughs> but we're going to go meet up with some other influencers at my resort that I'm staying at. And we're going to take pictures of a really nice spot. Five, ten minutes that way. I will follow you. <laughs> She's going <laughs> to Let's go check it out. Okay. <laughs> I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. Welcome to my country. Of course. Thank you. Shokra, my brother. That's that's Momo. Momo? Yeah. Momo. Camila. Camila, Camila my boy. Sam. Sam. All right. You will see Instagram pop up right below this video. One, two, three. Boom. You'll see it. And make sure you follow them. They're awesome content creators. We all met up in Egypt. Totally killing it. Let's go.
All right, guys, so we just finished shooting. It's approaching sunset. Me and Mama are really tired, uh, but I want to introduce you guys to the woman who's in charge of this place. Hi, guys. Uh, I'm Iman. I'm living here in Nuba, Aswan, Egypt, uh, in Radu Suhail, Nuba. This is our place, Anakato place. It's a very lovely place very authentic, all the, the factor of nature uh, around us, the Nile, the view, the birds, uh, the desert, uh, the greenery, everything, everything here is very nice. Please come and join our enjoyment here. Thank you. So you heard the lady, come to Nubian village, come to this spot, get some food, have a good time with your family and friends. This is the place to be. When you're coming to Aswan, when you come to Aswan, come to Nubian Village and come to this spot. You heard the lady. Come. Welcome, Welcome to Aswan. Aswan. Welcome, Welcome to Nubian, Nubian Village. Village. That's the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed my time in Aswan. People were lovely. I made a lot of friends this day and it is truly an amazing experience to be able to share this experience with you guys. Fortunately, it is the end of my video. So, like I always say, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm heading to Abu Simbel and that is gonna be a roller coaster of a video. So stay tuned, peace.